Hey dolls! So today I have a Lush haul for you guys. I am so, so, so excited about this because the company themselves actually reached out to me and asked me if I wanted to kind of do an unboxing review haul type video of some of their Christmas products. I love Lush so, so, so much. This is not a paid sponsorship at all. They just simply sent me this box of goodies to make a video about for you guys and I'm so excited about this because you guys know where I live I do not have a local Lush store uh, so I'm not able to test out the products or smell them or anything like that before I purchase I typically have to order online so let me know down in the comments down below what your favorite product is from Lush and uh, yeah with that being said let's get on into this video and don't forget that if this is the very first video you are seeing of mine hit that subscribe button down below this video okay Okay, so basically what Lush is doing now is they are starting to make some of their products without bottles or bulky packaging and they call it naked. So like for example they have naked shower gels meaning it's basically a solid bar of shower gel instead of being in a bottle and you have to squeeze it out. So it's kind of one of those things where it's helping the environment and to me that is really really cool. I love that concept so much. So the little card that they sent me says, hi Amanda, it's hashtag Lush Christmas. Tell us if you're going naked or nice. XOXO Nicole at Lush. So thank you so much again for this little box. They also sent a huge catalog of all the goodies. And then this little thing that has some of the new items on it that I will share with you guys. So for the items that actually didn't come in any sort of packaging at all, it was literally a box with just packing peanuts and these products were just loosely floating around. I'm glad that they are doing this during Christmas time because during summertime, this may be a complete disaster when they are shipping uh, during the hot summer months. So the fact that these are Christmas items and they're doing them kind of more towards the cooler season is very, very smart. Um, I'm not sure if they're going to try to continue it through the other seasons as well, but for now, um, they came all solid and not melted or destroyed at all. I'm gonna show you guys the naked products first. So this looks like a little plant pot and it is green. And what this is, is a solid body lotion. It is the once upon a time naked body lotion. And this smells so good. It's got kind of like a, uh, like a like a eucalyptus scent to it. The amazing thing that I love about these is since they are a solid but they're a body lotion, you just use the heat from your hands to warm up the product. And as you can see, I'm not sure if you can, but you can see how like oily that looks right now. That is the product dispensed onto my hands without the mess and fuss of a bottle. Our bathtub is currently on the fritz right now, so I can just take showers. So some of these items I'm keeping in little plastic bags to uh, savor them and maintain their freshness until I can actually use them in a bath. And then it, this one is also in here as well. You can see it kind of looks like a little plant pot. And this is the Snow Fairy Body Conditioner. And you guys look at the metallic shine on this. There's really a fine like purple glitters all throughout. It smells like sugar. Like I am addicted to the smell so much. It smells amazing. And basically what this is is it is a body conditioner. So you would use your typical shower gel and then rinse off your shower gel and then you would apply this like you would, a, you know, a hair conditioner. You know, you apply your shampoo first and you rinse it out, then you do your conditioner and then you rinse it out. And this is kind of the same thing. You do your body wash and then you do the body conditioner and then you rinse it off. And it just, oh my gosh, it smells so good. I'm gonna be using this today. like. I will be using this. I'm so excited for that. Then we have the Snow Fairy Naked Shower Gel. So this is just like that body conditioner. Same Snow Fairy scent. It's just very sugary. I can't get it out of the bag, sorry. I'm struggling. But it just looks like this. They shaped it like a shampoo bottle, like their classic packaging, which I think is so cute and creative. And it's nice and big so you can hold on to it and really scrub and then set it on a shelf very easily. Again, it just smells so sugary. It has that same scent, but as you can see, this one is matte. It doesn't have like any sh uh, shimmer in it at all. 
So if you want the scent but you don't want the shimmer, you can definitely pick the shower gel over the body conditioner. That smells so good. Oh my goodness gracious. And then we have one more. This is the Santa's Christmas Naked Shower Cream. But this one has kind of a unique scent. As you can see, it is the same as the pink one that I showed you guys a minute ago. And this is the Santa's Christmas. And this one is a little bit more of a masculine scent, I want to say. It's not so sugary and strong, but it's pleasant. It's very pleasant, and I quite like it as well. The shower gels and stuff I can definitely use in the shower, though. I don't need to wait to use those in the bath. Oh my gosh, my hands have so many different smells on them. It smells so good. Okay, uh, moving on. We have two bottled products here. This is the Santa's Christmas Shower Cream, and this is the Snow Fairy Shower Gel. So these are the exact same products that I just showed you guys that were in solid form, except they are in the physical bottle packaging. I'm pretty sure you get about the... Uh, maybe you get a little bit more product with this, but this is a solid, so it might take a little bit longer to use up. Again, this one is very similar to the solid body conditioner. It has the metallic purple shine in it. I know you guys can see that on camera. It looks so cool all in there. And again, this just smells... It still has the little cap on here. I haven't really peeled it off too much, but it just has that nice sugary smell. And I... Oh my gosh, and it's pink, you guys. It's pink, and it smells like sugar, and it's called Snow Fairy. Like, yes, I want this in every type of product they make. <laughs> All right, then we have two little pot products here. This is the Snow Fairy Body Conditioner, and you guys, you guys, you guys. Oh my gosh, this literally looks like liquid, like pastel bubblegum. It is so liquidy, though, so I'm not going to, like, show you too much, but it is a very, like milky consistency and it kind of smells like Pepto-Bismol. I'm not gonna lie like very very slightly. It's not overwhelming like obvious Pepto-Bismol but it smells like an underlying scent of it and I love that smell. So if you're someone who likes that smell then this is for you because it's pink and it's very liquidy and it does. It smells faintly like Pepto-Bismol. I don't know why I like that. It's weird, but it's it's awesome. So yeah, that's the Snow Fairy Body Conditioner um, in the uh, little tub form rather than the solid. And then we have the Once Upon a Time Body Lotion, which is the same as this, except this one is in the tub form rather than the solid form. And I just realized that the reason that this shape looks like a little plant pot, I mean, da da da, I should have thought of this before. It's the exact size of the container. It's like the same size and shape. It's like they solidified it while it was in the container and then just popped it out. So it's like you're getting the same amount of product just minus the bulky packaging. And then there are four little products in here. All four of them are the Santa Baby scent. Uh, so this is the Santa Baby Solid Lip Tint and this is the Santa Baby Solid Lip Scrub, which I'll show you guys in a second. But the lip tint is basically exactly what it says it is. It is a solid lipstick bar, and basically you just put it on, and the heat from your lips will soften the product, and it is a lip tint. I swatched this last night on my hand when I got the package, and you guys can still see there is still staining right there, so I'm sure that it will leave a nice little tinted stain, uh, which some people go for. I don't typically like when my lips are stained a certain color, but this could be fun during the holidays because it is bright red. Okay, and then like I said, this is the solid Santa Baby Lip Scrub. So you can see it comes in a little bar just like this and you just use it to exfoliate your lips. If you guys have never used a lip scrub before, usually they come in a little jar like this from Lush and you open it up and it just looks like a kind of pasty sugar consistency and what you do is you just apply it to your lips, scrub them, and then all of the kind of chapped lip excess skin will come off and it will exfoliate your lips and leave them soft and baby smooth. I love these types of lip scrubs so much from them so I know I'm probably going to love the solid form of it. I'm not 100% sure if you get the exact same amount of product with either of them but you can 
definitely probably do a little bit of research on the website and find out or just go to your local Lush and ask. Um, but this again smells really, really nice. I love it. And then the last thing is a little chapstick here that is a Santa Baby lip tint. So it is the same thing as that, if I can find it, the solid lip tint just in chapstick style. Just looks like so. And it just smells amazing. I'll go ahead and swatch it right here for you guys. Again, it's just a lip tint lip stain. Very pretty and perfect color for the winter. And with that, that is everything from my Christmas Lush haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I highly, highly recommend, sponsored or not sponsored, I've been a lover of Lush for a few years now, and I recommend them so much. They have, you guys probably know them most for their crazy, unique, awesome bath bombs, as well as a few other items. So definitely check out Lush. It's just Lush.com, I believe. I'll put the link in the description box below. And with that being said, I will talk to you all next time. So until then, so long, stay strong, stay true, and be you. All right, bye!